Hey folks, I'm here with Mike and we're going to be talking about Umbrella Corps. Mike, how are you today? I'm doing well. Awesome. So for the uninformed, what is Umbrella Corps? So Umbrella Corps is a fast-paced competitive team shooter set in the world of Resident Evil. Might be a little bit different than some of the other Resident Evil games you play. It's definitely focused on gathering up your team members and going into the arena, a PvP sort of match type of thing. Uh, we have a demo here at New York Comic Con. We're showing off our One Life match mode. So again, with it being really, really fast-paced, the matches are really, really quick. So it's about three minutes. Once you're out, you're out, and it's best of five. So. Awesome. I was playing it the other day, actually, and there are uh, zombies walking around on these playing fields. Uh, are there different types of zombies, or are there zombie bosses that people will be fighting, or are they just around there to mess people up? Right, so this is in the world of Resident Evil, like I mentioned before, so there are zombies. Uh, right now, we're only showing your sort of standard issue zombie. Stay tuned for more news and anything else, but um, the enemies in the environments, right now we're showing the Umbrella Lab. Uh, so there are zombies around there. Not only do you have to worry about the guys that are shooting at you, but you also have these things in your back called zombie jammers. At the, at the beginning of every single round, they emit these invisible waves that basically mess with the zombies' heads. The zombies don't pay attention to you. But, you know, with all the bullets flying around, grenades and stuff like that, if your jammer gets disrupted or broken, um, the zombies will instantly pay attention to you. So there's some strategy in there where you could use to, you know, sort of stick the zombies on the other team, but then again, they could do that back to you. So kind of that third force that's sort of unruly and sort of, you know, as the match goes on, it becomes pretty dynamic. Awesome. Now, going a little bit on almost story aspects of it, who are we in this? Are we the are we the Umbrella Corps? What, uh, who are we versing? What's going on with these teams? Right. So right now, we haven't said much about the, the basic story of the game, but the general premise is these are Umbrella Commandos. Uh, we have Team Alpha and Team Bravo. Um, we'll get more a little bit later as to, like, some of the specifics, but, again, this game isn't more, mostly focused on story. It's kind of just a super like straightforward we have our team shooter competitive we'll have different modes we'll have different stuff but right now we're just focusing on some of the basics so. awesome could you go into detail on any of the other game modes uh, right now we're focusing on one life match again since this is sort of a new idea for Resident Evil we wanted to make sure that we get people something that they understand so again super like a, a, a mode match it's very simple straightforward you have one match or sorry one life per round once everyone's eliminated, you get one point. Right now, we have it set to first of five, but a little bit later, we'll get into moves that are a little bit more different. So. Awesome. Now, you did mention that this is different for Resident Evil. It is quite different. We're used to the survival horror of Resident right, Evil. Right, right. What inspired you guys to make this team-based shooter? I mean, we've, we've experimented. So Resident Evil has been a little bit different over its, its story, almost 20-year history now. We're coming up on our 20th anniversary. Um, we've had old games, like the PlayStation 1 games, which have been more survival horror. We've had games that are over-the-shoulder, over the, over the shoulder, third person shooter. Um, we've had straight-up shooters as well. So this is something we're experimenting with. I mean, it's one of the things that we're offering during the 20th anniversary, but it's not the only thing. We've obviously got Resident Evil Zero, Resident Evil Origins Collection. We even announced the Resident Evil 2 remake coming up as well. So a little bit of something for everybody. Awesome. And finally, when can players get their hands on Umbrella Corps? So this is coming out in early 2016 on PlayStation 4 and PC. Awesome. Thank you so much. Great. Can't Thank wait to again. play. And for more content like this, go to shacknews.com.